The LSU Ag Center recently reported how the summer drought has impacted crawfish and rice farmers. As News 10's Dawson D'Amico reports, this year's harvest may be lower than normal because of high salinity levels infiltrating surface water. According to Todd Fontenot with the LSU Ag Center, the reason drought in Louisiana has experienced is causing salinity levels to rise in surface water, which is what is used for crawfish farms and rice crops. Um, the levels of salinity began to increase as um, the water levels drop, the salt water tends to come in um, into these waterways. Fontenot says a lot of farmers in the area use surface water instead of relying on deep water wells. The drought caused the salt water to move up north into the surface water which farmers use. Crawfish farmers use the surface water to flood their fields so the crawfish can come out of their burrows during the harvest season. Rice farmers also use surface water to flood their fields and for their irrigation systems. With higher levels than normal, Fontenot says this can cause a negative impact on the coming harvest. Unfortunately, um, people were wanting to finish up rice crops, some wanting to uh, flush their crawfish ponds because it has been so dry to help their either green rice or stubble from the rice to, to stay alive mm -hmm. so they'd have forage for their crawfish. Um, was starting to be concerned with the salt water levels the salinity levels. So they were bringing samples in and we were going out also and checking these waterways. The LSU Ag Center is looking to have more information on the salinity levels and how it will impact the coming harvests. Fontenot says they are coming up with different ways to assist however they can. Right, we're going to have the information uh, available for, like I mentioned, for our, uh, USDA will be most highly requesting numbers and uh, legislators and representatives will be requesting numbers. So we'll have that information for them. Fontenot says he hopes the salinity levels may not have as much of an impact as expected, but he says the only way to truly find out is to wait for the harvest. In Acadia Parish, Dawson D'Amico, KLFY, News 10.